hello everybody and welcome back to my channel um, we have got another food shop haul for you today Asda again um, Martin's just gone and collected it we did click and collect this week so this week I'll just give you the overview again this week it came to £92.15 so over my 85 budget but under my £100 budget that I do give myself but still it was still over the actual budget I like to <laughs> keep into but never mind let's get into the video and I'll show you what I got so we'll start with frozen stuff let's just move those so just some french fries and chicken nuggets for the girls because we've run out of those bits um, I've got two lots of ham and cheese curves they're for me and Martin's cheat day and garlic ones I have the ham and cheese Martin has the garlic and Martin asked me to buy an extra box of these so he can have two of those and one of these little piggy um, just one bag of the steam veg this week so I think I'm pretty sure we still got some left over in the freezer then I've got two pepperoni pizzas for the girls they're just so quick and easy and they really like those then back here we've got some light mayonnaise I always buy the light one whether I'm dieting or not that's the one I always buy um, just some muscle soak as you know we've been doing lots of exercise so that's quite nice to put in your bath after you've worked out um, some blue milk for Livy um, I popped up to the shop to get red milk the other day and we still got quite a lot left so I didn't bother buying our red milk uh, this on this shop I'll go up again another day Liv, um, not Livy, Sophie's tin of milk that I buy every week then I've got some balsamic vinegar and some runny honey because as you know we love having sticky chicken sticky pork every week so um, we'd run out of those so needed that then um, oh the girls love these actually I don't know if Livy did but Ava really likes these so we've got some cherry baked quails there that should have gone in my goodie section over there but never mind um, a couple of packs of frubes they really enjoy those when I do their picnic dinners I like to put one of these on there they love that got some salmon actually this is all higgledy piggledy so sorry about that I thought I'd put it more in an order but I haven't um, some creamy soft cheese I've done it again I thought this was like the low fat one and it isn't but never mind it'll get used at some point um, then back here I've got two packs of pork oh flipping heck I'm messing up today aren't I two lots of lamb chops and some loin steaks pork loin steaks they were three for ten pound and then I just got a pack of chicken I didn't buy the chicken thighs this week I just thought look at that nice bit of blood there yuck um, I just thought we'll go with breast this week just for a little bit of chicken change then my friend messaged the, me the other day saying Sean have you tried these not even seen these and she said they're like the Rolo pots I think she said so I had to get them because I knew these would be something that Martin would love. 69 calories per pot. So if they taste like the Rolo pots, that is going to be so nice, isn't it? Um, so yeah, I'll let you know what we think of those in another video. On to fruit. I've got a planet of raspberries, strawberries, blueberries and watermelon fans. We have still got a few bits of fruit in the fridge as well then on to bits for the girls picnic dinners we've got pepperon pepperamis they're just the 10 mini ones perfect size for the girls cooked chicken cooked ham then we've got some jacket potatoes which as you know we um, do into wedges um, or could have a jacket potato with um, i've got two packs of super noodles here the girls love super noodles so they're on my shopping every week more or less some more of these Warburton's Thins I've said this lots of times as well we really like these since we found these so I've got the white ones and the wholemeal ones but I believe they are the same co calorie content 
100 cows in those, 100 in them. So it doesn't actually really matter which ones you eat because they're worth, the calorie value is the same in either. Then I got some of this, Hartley's sugar-free jelly, the blackcurrant one. I thought it'll be a nice treat, like a nice pudding um, after a meal one day and a guilt-free one. Um, I thought it'd be fun for the girls to make it as well. So got that. Um, this was actually a substitute. So we've got chocolate mini rolls. I actually bought like the really cheap um, raspberry mini rolls and they are so, so nice. But anyway, they obviously didn't have them as substituted me for those. They're actually for the girls and Martin's got his eyes on those. But I've told him he can keep his hands off. Um, brioche um, instead of like the rolls I got the swells this week so that's breakfast for the girls this is some cafetier uh, coffee Costa coffee um, this was a substitute we did order a different one it was a Costa but it was a, a different one and I got this because for Martin's birthday it's in a couple of weeks but he's already had his present I bought him a milk frother so and it's really really good he's really impressed with it so he wanted some like coffee like this so then he can do his milk and put it on top um, a box of eggs I've remembered eggs this week so that's that then back here I've got two packs of Roysters love those and the girls love them um, so got two packs of those and then back here we've got some toilet roll I didn't buy Cashel this was a substitute I just bought I always buy the Asda shades the quilted one but they obviously didn't have that so that was the substitute then I got a pack of nappies for Soph um, two packs of mini fingers Livy devoured these last week they were a massive hit so instead of buying like other biscuits like the jammy dodgers and the mini ice rings I just got two packs of these this week because they really enjoyed those last week. Then I've got two packs of giant buttons. That's for me and Martin for our treat day. As usual, I always buy two packs of these every week. Although I've still got a whole heap in my sweet jar actually. So I might not need to buy two packs next week. Um, mini Haribo bags. And then I've got some mini Victoria sponges. Um, I follow a girl on... Instagram and she's just set up her own like bakery and I keep seeing cakes so I've been craving cakes so I've bought those for my treat the girl is actually sending me some brownies in the post Nutella brownies so I'm looking forward to trying those and then the last thing that we've got is Battenberg I think this is absolutely disgusting but Martin loves it so that's for Martin We've got a good few treats this week haven't we so yes that is everything and that came to 92 pound 15 I think I said at the beginning and that is it time to put it away I'll catch you in another video